So Faith has a rare condition called, yo, you got document out of that thing. Um, it's a very rare condition, only hits about 1% of the population. You know, I was really nervous about, you know, how Aaron would react. Guys, our water just broke. Look at that, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Great. Hi, my name's Aaron. I'm from San Diego, California, and I'm the father of Puppy Mom. When I found out Faith and I were having a dog, I was very supportive. But mostly confused. Right after Hazel was born, Aaron was like really skeptical. So we had to get a paternity test. So we went to a veterinarian. Hi! Welcome to Planned Puppy Parenthood! How are you today? Yes, um, I just brought in my daughter so that we could get a quick checkup and we needed to get her vitamins also. Got it. Gotcha. And then um, there was actually one more thing that I needed to do. Um, it's a little bit personal. If we could just talk to the vet. Yeah, we can definitely do that here. Thank you. Have you been here before? She said, have you ever been here before? Okay, fine. No, it's actually our first time. Okay. Okay. And what's your first name? Yeah, that's F-A-I-T-H. And this is Hazel, H-A, thank you, okay, Z-E-L, alright, okay, so you're just gonna go ahead and fill out this paper here, this is the application, just go ahead and fill out everything with an X on it, and bring it back when you're done, okay, here you go, okay, alright, just the X's, okay, perfect. Here's a pen. Awesome. Thank you. Alrighty. Can I just go sit over here? Yeah, just let me know if you have any questions. Perfect. Alright. So we have to fill this out. Alright, let's go. Okay. Hi. I got everything filled out for you. Here you go. Oh, perfect. You're all set. Okay. Now let me take a look at your paperwork. <clears throat> okay, so this is this is regarding a paternity test? Yeah. Um for your dog. Yes. Okay. Um, yeah, all right. Well, perfect. Looks like everything is signed, and I will get this into the vet. Okay, all right, perfect. Thank you. Thank you. Just go ahead and have a seat over there. Okay, um, she can sit with you in the waiting room. We have some toys, too. Right over here? Sure, yeah. Okay, okay, thanks. Okay, all right. Okay. Hi, I'm Dr. Lipschitz. I was the previous physician of uh, Faith and Aaron's uh, puppy dog. Um, it was the first ever surgery I've done um, like that, and it's the first one known to man. I've gotten countless requests on invasive and risky surgeries. So since then, I've been watching a lot of Grey's Anatomy. I can definitely do that. I've gone a little bit extreme with it, and I've lost a couple patients. And I've been looking for a job. 
And I decided to apply to be a veterinarian. And, um, here they are again. I'm just a little bit nervous to do the paternity test today because, I mean, there was that one night. Yeah. But, um... Hopefully we get good news and it's errands because I would hate to go through a nightmare like that if it weren't his. Alrighty guys, I'm just going to get a quick saliva sample and we'll get that figured out for you. Can I have your daughter? Okay, say ah. Okay, baby girl. All right, Hazel. It's going to okay. be really quick. Thank oh, you. Oh, good yeah, girl. Good oh, good girl. Good girl. Okay, it's going to be five to ten minutes, and I'll figure out who your father is. Okay, thank you. Be right back. Thank you. So it was confirmed that Aaron was the father of Hazel. So I found out I was the dad today. I mean really surprised um, but it's gonna be good for us we can finally move on with our lives he's the father and I couldn't be happier this is honestly the best ever I was so scared but I knew he was the father so I'm finally moving on with my life and I'm finally accepting that I have a daughter who's a dog. Faith's been such a good mother to Hazel. We've, uh, we've done a lot. We've gone to the park. She's breastfeeding. It's really um, amazing to see her as a mother and I'm just I'm so blessed to be in this position as a father. Hey, get out of there. Get out of there. And you are not wearing dresses like that anymore. Aaron has been just a most, the most phenomenal dad ever. He has helped me with everything with Hazel. He bathes her, he wipes her butt. Go pee pee. Poo poo. Come on. Go poo poo. Come on. Great job, Hazel, you did it! Good poo poo! He, he buys her toys, he plays with her. It's honestly just been amazing being Hazel's mom. And I love her so much, and I love our little family. We go to the doctor's office about every month, once a month, and we just get her a checkup, and we've been keeping up with her vitamins. So yeah, we're just trying to keep her really healthy because they're new parents, and it's been really exciting to take good care of her. And yeah, we're just really, really awesome parents. So despite Dr. Lipschitz losing his um, license, we like to visit him quite often just to get our checkups on Hazel, making sure she's a very healthy daughter dog. Hey guys, Hazel. Hey, Darren. Hi. Hey. Come on in. Come on, guys. Let's go. All right. Being a dog mom, I get a lot of looks. I get a lot of looks at the stores and when I'm walking with her. I mean, people just don't understand that she's different. And I mean, she's really just like everyone else. What did you do today, Hazel? Tell me. But you know, her condition is just a little bit different than other kids. I was also looking into going into a support group for women who have also gone through, yo, you got a dog coming out of that thing. So it's been great, honestly, I can't wait. My first class or my first meeting is gonna be next week. So we're super excited about that. Oh my goodness. Oh my there you go, Hazel. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on. Yes, let's go. Come on, Hazel. Come on, yes. Good girl. Come on. Oh. oh. Yay! Yay! Being 
a mother has been one of the most magical things I could ever ask for and well Hazel is just better than any human you know she's she's the best dog I could have ever had like having her in my womb was just it was so beautiful to carry her and to feel her kicking me every day and she would also bite me like you know the inside I would feel her little nipples in there just trying to get out but it was just beautiful and you know honestly I can't wait to have that feeling again <sighs> I think actually I might be pregnant What the?